Have you ever noticed how some popular sites will show a reading progress bar indicator at the top of their articles? This little bar is a great indicator that shows just how much more of the article is left and encourages people to read. So we're going to show you how to get that on your site. So let's dive in. The easiest way to show the reading progress bar is by installing a plugin. We're going to head over to our WordPress dashboard. We want to go down to plugins, add new, and the one we're looking for, we're going to search for worth the read. This is the one we want. It's the simple and effective one. So let's go ahead and click installed now. And then stick around to activate the plugin as well. And what do you think the psychological reason is for the progress bar? Let us know in the comments what your thoughts are on that. Now that it's activated, you can come back over on the left, scroll all the way down. It might be down at the bottom. We want to go do worth the read, reading progress. And under the functionality tab, this is where you can set everything up. This is where you want to choose what all to display it on. So I'm going to say let's do it on the posts. You can do pages and home page. I'm not going to do it on that. If you have custom post types, then you can do it on those as well. If you want to include comments for how long it might take them, you can add that here. And then down here, you can choose the placement. Where do you want this to go? Where do you want the notification to show? I'm going to do it at the top, but notice that you have a few other options that you can choose from. And then there are also a few other items that you can go in, but this is the best that we need. This is the most of what we need to make changes. So let's go ahead and click Save Changes. And let's also look at the Style tab. From here, you can choose the thickness and the foreground color, as well as the opacity, as well as the background color. The background color is the empty progress bar, so what you haven't progressed to yet. And this is the foreground. You can choose whatever you want it to be. These colors look fine for us. So we're also going to click Save Changes. And now when you go to a blog post, you can see the progress bar as you're scrolling. And now if you're looking for a way to find popular posts and add them to your blog post, then watch this video next as I show you how to add the popular posts to your WordPress website. And I'll see you over there.